What's up guys, welcome to another video. Today I'm gonna be showing you that I'm gonna be selling my Bitcoins because it's at an all time high and it's gonna start dropping in around two or three days. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, okay, but don't get me wrong. I'm really happy that we are an all time high in Bitcoin. And I've, I know you have seen on my videos that I'm always hodling until for like 10, 20 years, but this is a really, really good opportunity. I'm gonna show you the Bitcoin chart and I'm gonna explain you exactly why I'm gonna be selling it. And it's not gonna be for for dollars, I'm gonna be changing it for an altcoin actually. So this is the Bitcoin chart and as you can see, it has grown exponentially and I love that. But even though uh, we gotta sell at some point, right? And right here on the RSI, as you can see, the last time it went all the way up here, look how it dropped, like really, really hard. And even if it didn't drop all the way down, every time Bitcoin uh, was touching this area it was dropping like 30 or 40 percent let's take a look from right here all the way to the bottom that's like a like a 36 percent drop and i don't know let's see on the next one all the way from here to here to here that's like another 37 percent drop and i mean i'm not saying we're gonna go into a bear market but i think we're gonna start dropping in around two or three days because it's never been a week that we've been on this area anytime in the past. So let's say if it starts dropping in one or two days, maybe it goes a little bit more to the upside, but I don't think it's gonna be that much. And if it goes down around like the 36% that the, all the past times have, have, that has done that, it's probably gonna go around 19,000, 18,000, and that's just still pretty good. Like every time Bitcoin goes I mean, it grows parabolic. It needs to eventually come down and, you know, like charge batteries and then start the next the next bull run. And I'm still pretty bullish. I think we can achieve uh, probably like around 150,000 Bitcoin uh, next year. I mean, this year. But right now it needs to just charge batteries. Uh, I think it might go a little bit more to the upside, but I don't think it's going to be that much. And that's exactly why I'm going to be selling it. And... The million dollar question, what am I going to be selling my Bitcoin for? Well, it's actually Cardano. Uh, this is the graph on Cardano, as you can see. It's been bleeding in the past months. And as you can see, there's this bull pattern. And I think it's going to break to the upside. And that's how I think there's going to be an out season. And I'm just waiting for it to drop a little bit more. Maybe just... It's, it's right there. I'm probably just going to buy it after this video. But I've been waiting for the last five days for it to drop a little bit more. And then buy. I, I'm ready. I have my, my wallet here on Binance. 1.2 Bitcoin ready to deploy for ADA. Right here is the chart. ADA BTC. And I'm just just really, really excited. And even if, if I make a mistake and Bitcoin does go to the moon and there's no alt season, I think Cardano is still going to... I still it's still gonna go up. Maybe I'm not gonna make those crazy gains as with Bitcoin, but I think right now, since Bitcoin is at thirty thousand dollars, even if it goes to a hundred fifty thousand dollars, let's see, let's say if Bitcoin goes to one hundred and fifty thousand dollars divided by thirty thousand. So you can multiply your money by five if you leave it in, on Bitcoin. If it reaches one hundred and fifty thousand, maybe it can go a little bit more up. But I don't really think so. I think 150 is a really good target. And with Cardano, if it only goes to its all-time high, right now it's at 0.18. But last time it was uh, $1.33 at the all-time high with Cardano. Divided by the price right now that it's probably like around 18, 17. You're, you're going to be making your money 7.3 times more. And if there's an out season, I'm pretty sure they're going to outperform Bitcoin by a lot. Every time there's an out season, the outs out, outperform Bitcoin by seven times that. So if Bitcoin goes five times uh, from, from the price that it's now, let's say five times times six or seven times that outs outperform Bitcoin, outs are going to grow 30%. 30 times by outs are gonna go up by 30 times the price that they are right now. Let's say Cardano it's at point 18 cents multiply by 30. So we could see a Cardano price at 5.4 dollars 
And I think the risk reward right now, it's just crazy if you just buy altcoins. And yeah, it's gonna be hard to know when to sell because you never know when it's gonna be the top or when is the bottom. But I think the risk reward that Cardano has, I think it's pretty decent and that's exactly what I'm willing to sacrifice my last Bitcoin for Cardano. So let's see if that works out. Um, I'm gonna be doing uh, crypto portfolio up updates like I've been doing. And I think it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun, I'm ready for it. And happy new year to everyone. I hope you get a really nice 2020 because I think if you were investing in crypto at the beginning of the year of 2020, you really had a, a good performance on your money. So good for you. Let's let's keep it up in 2020. And well, I'm gonna be trying to acquire as much Cardano as I can. I was actually trying to buy, um, I have 45 Moneros. I was trying to trade them for Cardano, but Monero is dropping really, really hard right now. So I'm just gonna be waiting. And yeah, I'll keep you guys updated. If you wanna follow me on my Instagram, I'm gonna be doing daily updates too. I have a Discord channel if you wanna join as well. And well, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you like it, subscribe for more. And as always, thank you for watching. Trapping out the bandos.